Good morning ladies and gentlemen, I'm MeanZ69, welcome back to the channel and we have a new defender in the game, the TSL7 defender. Um, I gotta admit, it does look the part, I think it looks absolutely fantastic, but I wish it could play as good as it looks. Honestly, I don't rate this tank at all, uh, that could just be me. You could get the tank and you might absolutely love it. I really don't know. But I do not rate this tank. I don't think it's... Uh, you can have decent battles, but I just think it misses too much. Uh, yes, it does have a good turret. You need to try and get that on a, on a ridge. 254 millimeters of turret armor. So really, you have to sit on a ridge. But even sat on a ridge, I don't know if... Um, I haven't really looked at the armor profile, but even sat on a ridge... I'm just being pinned by everything. Uh, so, yeah, it's, the armor's not great. Uh, the gun's not great. The speed's, I mean, it's okay. But I just feel it could have been a bit better. Uh, that is that is all it is. I'm not saying the tank is completely useless. Uh, I think it's okay. That is literally as far as I'm going to go. It is okay. Again, please bear in mind, this is my own opinion. And I can only speak on my own opinion. Go watch Droodles' video. He may absolutely love the tank. You never know. He may do. He may hate it. We never know. Uh, but that's why I always say, don't always go by my word. Because, again, everybody's opinion is different. So, again, I might say it's bad. Droodle might say it's really good. And then you could decide which person, you know, you might have my kind of play style. Or you could have Droodles' kind of play style. Um, but if I'm saying it's bad, Droodles is saying it's bad, and other players are pl saying it's bad, then most likely it is bad. Uh, but I can only talk on my opinion, so, and I'm saying it's not as good as I'd hoped it to be. Uh, DPM 2150, you do have a 12.8 second magazine reload, which I don't think is too bad for the magazine, to be fair. Uh, you've got three, sh uh, three seconds for each uh, shells, uh, yeah, I think that could lower a bit to be fair. You've got three shells in your magazine. Your penetration 227 on your AP, 257 on your APCR, that is with calibrated shells, and 46 on your HE. You've got a 225 alpha gun. I wish it was just a little bit more because uh, I don't think that is effective at all. The same as if you have to use your APCR, which you're going to have to, 190. Uh, is just not a lot, to be fair. 270 on your HE. Aim time is pretty good at 2.7. Gun dispersion, not as good at 0 0.321. And you do have 9 degrees of gun depression to go with that turret. Um, and a top speed of 42 kilometers per hour. Uh, so, yeah, some people may like it, but I, 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 I don't. I just... I just, I just don't like it. Uh, I do think it looks the part, though. I do think it looks absolutely fantastic. So I do give it to Wargaming uh, with the looks because it does look amazing. I'm not going to lie. Just look how beautiful this tank actually does look. And I, I would probably, depend on obviously the price, but if it was for gold, then I could, I would probably get it just for the looks because it's, it, at the end of the day, it is a Defender tank. Um, as we know, the Defender tanks nowadays... Are not as special as they as they used to be. When the IS-3 Defender was first released into the game, it was like insane, absolutely insane. But nowadays, nobody is scared of an IS-3 Defender. Um, in fact, most IS-3 Defenders are not really great players, so uh, they do struggle in that tank. Um, but this tank, it definitely is a ridgeline tank. It really is. You have to get on a ridge and. Uh, you have to try and move as well. Don't just sit there because if you just sit there, then they will be able to aim at your weak points. I mean, here, I got absolutely obliterated at the start. But on top of that, I did actually get some bounces. So it's not all doom and gloom. Uh, but yeah, you have to try and use that ridge and you have to try and use that nine degrees of gun depression to be able to get them bounces. Uh, so we've got the Lerva here. Can we get a bounce? Are we going to hide? Is, you know, he, he pens me very easy there. Like, too easy too freaking easy uh but luckily we did get that bounce at the beginning i mean then bounces at the beginning 580 because otherwise we will be completely dead uh but yeah i do find it struggle 
I had a quite a few games just trying to get the footage and I just couldn't. I just kept dying or I wasn't doing a lot of damage. In the end, I'm just like, you know what? I'm just going to use these. I'm just going to use these because I don't enjoy playing the tank. And that's what I do look at now. Um, will I enjoy playing the tank? And even though this tank probably isn't like the best of tanks, but uh, it's... It's not enjoyable. It's, it, even if it's okay, it's not enjoyable. Uh, and that's what I look at, at tanks now. If I buy the tank, how often am I going to be playing the tank? Uh, and that is not a lot at all. Uh, I, I get people are going to buy it though, because they want it to go with their collection. They're going to want the tank to go with their Defender collection, which is absolutely fine. You know, it's up to you what you spend your money on. Uh, what is there, four, five other Defenders now? Four? I think there's four other Defenders, so five in total. I didn't think they were going to keep making the Defenders. I thought actually they were going to stop. Um, but no, clearly not. It is clearly still coming. Um, but yeah, I mean, the TSL, uh, the TSL7 Defender, um, but it looks great. It Honestly, it, it does look great. I'm not going to take that away from Wargaming because it, it does look absolutely uh, amazing. So well done Wargaming for, for that part. Um, but yeah, let me know. Let me know. Do you like the Defenders? Because... Oh, I just fast forwarded it too much there um, because generally I don't mind the defenders yes you've got the IS-3 defender the T-28 defender uh, but you do actually have a couple of good defenders uh, is it the Carnarvon um, you know, there's, there is a couple of uh, good defenders and I hope they do keep carrying them on because it is like a good thing to have and people are going to want to collect these kind of tanks uh, just like the titan tanks i originally thought they was going to stop with the defenders and start making more titan tanks but they they released a couple of defenders in the last year or so so you know hopefully they do keep it going um but i hopefully they 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 start to get better but i could be wrong who knows i could be talking absolute shit and these, this tank could be absolutely fantastic but uh that's just my opinion so if you do have the tank let me know in the comments below or are you going to get the tank have you played the tank let me know in the comments below what you actually think of the this tank let me know in the comments below but for now hope you enjoyed today's video guys i'm miji69 um i don't know how the tank is coming by the time this video is released you should already know i don't know if it's a gold i don't know if it's for crates I, I really don't know but by the time this video is released you should already know. Um, so I, I would just say, wait at the moment. It's not worth it. However much it is, it's not going to be worth it. But I uh, hope you enjoyed today's video. I'm Meiji69, and I will catch you all soon. Bye-bye.